always mess up and cry out. Ideally, we'd have both or one healthy parent or grandparent we could cry out or share with. But some of us didn't have that growing up. The cool thing is we have our Heavenly Father we can cry out to. And the Holy Spirit brings something up in scripture in a talk. If you're already doing inventory, already bringing things up to the Lord, then you're already doing things that need to be done. Don't heat more things on your plate the Holy Spirit isn't convicting you of. The Bible deals with lots of different things. Remember, we have security in Christ. It's not what we did, but what He did on the cross. Correction from the Holy Spirit is like coaching from a soccer coach to help us in different areas. Sometimes we can get overwhelmed by troubles, feel bleak, hopeless. It's good for you to know God listens to our cries. We're privileged to have the Bible, which tells us about God and His power, and when we call out to Him. No situation is hopeless when we have God. We might feel helpless. We need to look at God and hope in His deliverance, which we have because of what He did on the cross. God is safe for us to share our sin with. We know we need people that are safe to share our weaknesses with emotionally safe. Most people aren't criminals or do criminal acts, but some people aren't safe to be around emotionally. When we're vulnerable in relationships, we need to be able to share our weaknesses and struggles. When we share our struggles, how do they act? Critical or empathetic? Empathetic, they're safe to be around emotionally. Look, self, safe people helps you identify the type of people that you can share those things with that are emotionally safe. God allows us free will, allows us to make mistakes, sin, stumble, and fall. He allows us to learn personally about the consequences of sin, consequences of our actions. We should remember that God doesn't make us fall. Natural consequences can kick in when we make bad choices and sin. We might have a time of suffering the consequences because of choices, but we can learn from it and turn to God. Even in our biggest mess-ups, we can cry out to God.